With RecCon coming up, it's important to make sure that you're completely prepared to make the most at this once a year event. So here's exactly what you should be doing to prepare. And yeah, since RecCon hasn't started yet, I'm just gonna have to make the most out of this store template instead. Sorry. First, you've got to save up your tokens if you want anything from the limited edition items at that storefront. That could mean anything from resisting the urge to buy the item that you really want but know you'll never wear, or grinding games of dodgeball until you stop earning rewards every day. But trust me, it's definitely worth it. Look at this shirt that I got with a picture of a tennis ball on it that says rock. Okay, maybe some items are worth it more than others. Next, you've got to make sure that you're spending your tokens on the right things once you're there. Now, I'm not going to give you fashion advice on what clothes to buy. I mean, have you seen what I've bought? But there's one rule that everyone should know. Do not gift the beggars. Once you gift one person, a hundred more will just show up out of nowhere and start begging you too. If you've ever been to Retcon, you've definitely seen this before. And don't count on your willpower alone. From personal experience, I know that I'll eventually end up gifting someone something small and instantly get over with a ton of people. So, how can you avoid this overall? Well, there's actually a few ways to deal with it. Oh, and by the way, I'm gonna switch up locations because this store is really grey and boring. Eh, I guess this'll do. One, just mute people. It's that easy. You can just toggle the slider to only be able to hear your friends and no one will be able to beg at you. Two, dress down. Maybe wearing all of your most expensive items to an event with tons of beggars isn't the best idea. Just turn down your outfit a little bit so people don't think that you're super rich and ask you for tokens. 3. Just stay away from the storefront in general. There's so much interesting stuff that you could do at Retcon, maybe go explore those instead. Another thing that you can do to prepare is just sort out your schedule. There's a ton of panels at Retcon where you can watch different people talk about various things, and if you don't make time for them, you could miss them all together. There's usually a few panels with RecTubers at each Retcon, and this one will be no exception. Keep an eye out for them and you might find something that you like. So, maybe you should subscribe so I can get invited to one one day. Please, I'm desperate. My final tip is just to get a group of friends to go with. Going alone can get pretty boring and exploring alone can really lose its charm. Grabbing some friends and exploring all the rooms in Retcon can be one of the most fun things to do in the game. Especially with a hundred make pen skins being hidden around the convention this time, having a group of friends can really help you more easily find them and make the whole thing a lot less boring. Hey, thanks for watching to the end. Maybe check out one of these videos next and I'll see you next time. Bye!